As part of our First Time Voters Campaign Initiative by the Youth Bridge Foundation, representatives of these young first time voters from all the regions in Ghana paid a courtesy call on the Electoral Commission of Ghana. This particular engagement is expected to touch on reforms that have been made ahead of elections 2020 in order to render transparency, peace and also all-inclusive elections in December 7th, 2020 polls. All thanks to the Canada Fund for Local Initiative for supporting this particular campaign. Just stay connected and learn more. It's a pleasure to welcome the Youth Bridge Organization to the Electoral Commission this afternoon. More importantly, we value the initiative of the first time voters. I think this is a very novel initiative and we commend the Youth Bridge Organization highly for staying the course. And I, I think it's important that we, we mention that we, uh, we associate ourselves with this initiative. As the Electoral Commission, we are very excited and keen at the interest that first time voters have shown in this process, let me respectfully say that we brought the youth first time voters from across the country. We have the northern region represented, central region represented, uh, voter region, eastern region with Accra, and uh, we have the hearing impaired, the visually impaired here. So, our uh, issue of inclusion is well, well enforced. We always see a bipart meeting and political parties, the leaders always meeting. But the audience at the Electoral Commission with the youth, this, I must say, is the first time I'm here. And you will be very good. Youth Bridge Foundation had an analysis on the voter registration that Ghana had. And we realized that the youth voter population was over 60%. And then when we, we did further analysis, we realized that the first time voter population of that number was over 20 percent so we decided as an organization to find ways of mobilizing these youth first-time voters to make sure that they make informed decisions if the EC could consider donating old vvr machines to secondary schools and tertiary institutions to be used in facilitating administration of students the use of facilities examinations and to prevent impersonation will be very grateful. Thank you. She is urging the electoral commission that if he can, can continue with the electoral processes so that all citizens in the various districts, if you attain the legal age of 18, you can go and do the registration. Thank you. To read the visually impaired, I'll be hopeful that a time will come that we will have elections, electoral processes, and voting in real or maybe in audio form. Yes, thank you. I want to highly commend the Electoral Commission for disqualifying the candidates that forge signatories <laughs> into the nation. Because we are the future leaders and they are to prepare us. What are they teaching us by doing those kind of things? So I highly commend the EC for disqualifying them. On behalf of We the First Time Voters, we present to you our call to action. My name is Jean Mensa, I'm the chairperson of the Electoral Commission. I support the First Time Voters campaign and encourage all first time voters to go out in their numbers to vote on the 7th of December 2020. The program was very educative, I've learned a lot and I urge all first-time voters to take part and join the first-time voters campaign train. I do think the campaign is significant to me in the sense that once I'm informed about the electoral processes, I can also go out there and inform my peers and they will be able to make um, decisions that are coming from a background where we know that it's research-based. I'm really privileged to be here and privileged to vote on 7th December. I took a, a point from her explanations that violence isn't the answer. We need a peaceful election. Just go in your numbers. Just vote for who you want to be the president for the next year. That's all. We've come to the end of the entire program. Thank you so much for staying with us. If you are a first-time voter out there and you haven't registered to be a part of this coveted campaign, just call the number beneath the screen or visit our website and get yourself registered. My name once again is Sutherland Dombo. 
This first time voters campaign is brought to you by Youth Bridge Foundation, endorsed by Electoral Commission of Ghana and supported by Canada Fund for Local Initiatives. Let's stay safe.